hi everybody and uh, once again welcome to pankaj's echelon tutorials and uh, we are going to continue with our uh, matrices and transformation chapter from david renner book the fourth edition okay so in the previous video i think uh, i had completed uh, uh, 16 question and we were on to the 17th question so now we are going to start from the 17th question so 17th question is this one okay it says that uh, you have to find out uh, dg dg okay so dg means the multiplication of the matrix d with the matrix g okay so first of all let us see what is this matrix d and g so d according to my textbook is uh, 1 5 and 1 and uh, 4 minus 6 and a uh, 1 okay this is my d This you have to multiply by G, and G is four, uh, one, and three. Okay, so this is the multiplication that we have to carry on. Now, first step is to check the compatibility whether the multiplication is first of all possible or not. For that, what you have to see is first see what is the order of the matrix D. So, order of the matrix D is two by three because it is two rows and three columns. And the order of this matrix G is uh, uh, three rows and one column, so it is three by one. Okay. Now you can see that this inner numbers, okay, three and three, both are same. And because they are same, the multiplication is possible, and the product will be of order two by one. Okay. So this will be the matrix of order two by one. Okay. So two by one should look something like this two rows and oh, sorry two by one so it should look something like this okay so uh, that being the case now you have to just fill up these two columns okay so this is a one one and this is a two one this is a one one this is a two one okay now to find out a one one what I'll do is From the first matrix, I'll take the first row, and from the second matrix, I'll take the first column. That is this column. It has only one column, so I'll have to take this, and you'll have to multiply. Okay, so four ones are four, plus five ones are five, plus three ones are three. This works out to four plus five is nine, nine and three is twelve. So I will have to write here twelve. Okay, now coming to A two one. For A two one, I'll have to take the second row of the first matrix and the first column of the second matrix. Okay, so it is four minus six one multiplied by four one three. So four into four is sixteen. Plus minus six into one is minus six. Plus one into three is three. This works out to sixteen minus six plus a three. This is ten plus three. Which is equal to 13. I'll have to write here 13. So this is the answer for my product DG. Okay, so matrix D multiplied by matrix G will give me the answer as this one. Okay, so let me check the answer behind, and uh, this is for the question number 17, right? And uh, yeah, the answer is uh, 12 and 13. Correct. It's a column matrix. And the two elements are twelve and thirteen. Now let us move on to eighteenth. Question number eighteenth. Question number eighteenth is uh, uh, it's A J. A J. See, we have a lot of uh, 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 matrix uh, problem on multiplication. Okay, now. So we are getting a good practice of this multiplication of the two matrices. So here the two matrices are A and J. So A is uh, uh, two minus one, three and a four. Okay, and J is uh, three and one. So the order of this is two by two. The order of this is two by one. Uh, since these two are same, okay, therefore. The multiplication is compatible, and the product will be of order this two by this one. Okay, so 
2 by 1 means there will be 2 rows and 1 column. So, you will have to fill up these 2 places. Okay. So again, this will be A11, this will be A21. Now, A11 will be equal to what? So, you will have to take first row from the first matrix and first column from the second matrix and multiply. So, 2 into 3 is 6 plus minus 1 into 1 is minus 1. This is 6 minus 1 equal to 5. So, I will get a 5 over here. Okay. Now, for this place, 2, 1. A, 2, 1. I will have to take second row of the first matrix and the first column of the second matrix. So, 3, 3 is are 9 plus 4, 1 is 4. 9 plus 4 is 13. So, I will get a 13 over here. So, this has to be the answer for A, J. That is 5, comma, uh, I mean 5, 13. Okay. It is a column matrix with elements 5 and 13. So, let me check the answer for the 18 and it is correct 5 and 13. Right. So, let us quickly move on to the next one that is 19. Now, 19th question says that uh, okay, 19th question is uh, it's a HK HK okay. So, my H is uh, let me tell you what is H yeah, H is uh, a 0 1 and a minus 2 3 minus 4 and a 5 okay this is my h okay and this has to be multiplied by matrix k k is 1 minus 3 and then 0 1 and then minus 7 and 0 okay so first let us check the compatibility this is a 3 by 2 matrix okay this is a 3 by 2 matrix again okay this is uh, sorry this is 2 by 3 matrix uh, this is uh, 2 rows and 3 columns 2 by 3 matrix and this is 3 by 2 matrix so you can see that these two are same okay therefore the product is possible and the product will be of the order this 2 by this 2 okay so it's a 2 by 2 matrix the product will be 2 by 2 matrix so, I'll have to put this four blanks over here. This is representing 2 by 2 matrix. Okay. This will be position A11, A12. This is A21. This is A22. Now, A11 will be what? This one represents the first row of the uh, this thing, first matrix. And this one represents the first column of the first matrix, second matrix. Okay. So, you have to multiply that. So, 0 into 1 is 0. Plus 1 into 0 is again 0. Plus minus 2 into minus 7 is uh, plus 14. So, my answer for this A11 is plus 14. So, I will get a 14 over here. Okay. Then, for this position, what I will do is this row and this column I will multiply. Okay. This row with this column. Okay. So, 0 into minus 3 is 0 and 1 into 1 is 1 and uh, minus 2 into 0 is 0. So, I will get just 1 into 1, 1 over here. Okay. So, I will get a 1 over here. Okay. Then, let me move on to the next one. That is uh, this position. Okay. So, this one. So, I will go to the second row and the first column. Okay. These two. So, it will be 3 into 1 will be 3, 3 into 1, 3, minus 4 into 0 is 0 and 5 into minus 7 is minus 35, okay. So, 3 minus 35 will work out to minus 32, so I will get a minus 32 over here. Now, this is left, okay. So, this is second row, second column. So, this is second row and this is second column, okay. So, 3, 3 is our 9, that is minus 9. This is minus 3, okay. And minus 4 into 1 is minus 4. And this is 5 into 0 will be 0, okay. So, this will be minus of 13. So, this is minus of 13. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, yeah. So, this is the answer, right. Let us check the answer for the 19th. The answer for the 19th is... Uh, it's a 14 and a 1 and minus 32 and a minus 13. So, this is absolutely correct again. Okay. Let us move on to the 20th one. 
question number 20 yeah now question number 20 says that uh, you have to find out uh, uh, a b and then a c a b is in bracket and then you have a c okay so this first of all you'll have to write this way a b is what okay so a b will be a is uh, my uh, a is 2 minus 1 3 and then 4 and my b is uh, 0 5 1 and minus 2 okay this is my a b now i'll put a bracket of another type okay this bracket and then i'll write this c so matrix c is what it is 4 3 1 and minus 2 okay so what you have to do is first you have to get the resultant of this two matrix cup product whatever resultant you get that you have to multiply with this matrix okay that will give you the final answer so let us work out first this one this will be equal to now this is 2 by 2 and this is also 2 by 2 so product will also be 2 by 2 okay so first row first column two zeros are zero minus one into one is minus one so minus one and right here then this position okay uh, this row and this column okay five twos are ten and minus two into one is minus one into minus two is two so ten plus two is twelve five then three zeros are zero and uh, three zeros are zero and four ones are four so 0 plus 4 is 4. I'll write a 4 over here. Then this position will be second row and second column. So 3 into 5 is 15. 15 minus 8. 15 minus 8 is 7. Okay. So I got the answer. Okay. Now I'll have to multiply this by this particular matrix. Okay. That is 4, 3, 1 and minus 2. Again the same thing. Okay. It will be a 2 by 2 matrix. So first row and this column. So minus 4 plus 12 minus 4 plus 12 so it will be 8 okay then first row and second column okay this one minus 3 minus 24 minus 3 minus 24 is minus 27 okay then second row and the first column okay 4 4 are 16 plus 7 1 are 7 16 plus 7 16 plus 7 is how much 16 plus 4 is 20 20 plus 4 is 20 plus 3 is 23 okay then the last one this row and this column so 4 3 is at 12 12 minus 14 12 minus 14 is minus 2 so this is the answer okay now this time i was very fast and i did everything uh, mentally most of the things okay so let us check the answer now 20th ka answer is uh, 8 and a minus 27 23 and a minus 2 perfect okay so that was question number 20 let us move on to question number 21 okay 21 is uh, it's a a and into bracket bc okay it is a into bracket bc so you have to write in this order only so first i'll write matrix a which is nothing but uh, uh, 2 minus 1 uh, a 3 and a 4 okay this is matrix a and this bc i will write inside a square bracket so b is uh, 0 5 1 and minus 2 okay and c is uh, 4 uh, 3 1 and minus 2 okay fine now here what i'll do is first i will find the resultant of this okay then whatever answer i get for this i will multiply with this okay so let us get the answer for this first so for this the answer will be 0 into 4 is 0 plus 5 into 1 is 5 so 0 plus 5 is 5 then this position i want okay so first row and second column so 0 into 3 is 0 and 5 into minus 2 is minus 10 so we get minus 10 over here now this position second row first column so 4 ones are 4 4 minus 2 4 minus 2 is 2 okay then this position 
second row, second column. 3 ones are 3 plus uh, minus 2 into minus 2 is 4. So 3 plus 4 is 7. So I get this as the answer. Now this has to be multiplied by this matrix. Okay. So this is 2, minus 1, 3 and 4. Again the same way. First row, first column. So 5 twos are 10, minus 2 is 8. Then first row, second column. Minus 10, minus 20, minus 7. So it will be minus 27. Okay. Second row, first column. 5 threes are 15, plus 4 twos are 8. 15 plus 8 is how much? 15 plus 5 is 20. 20 plus 3 is 23. Then second row and second column. So it will be minus 30 plus 7 fours are 28. Minus 30 plus 28. This will be minus 2. So the answer is 8 minus 27, 23 minus 2. Now if you see carefully, this answer is matching with the answer of the previous one. That is 20. Okay. See for question number 20 also. We got the answer as 8 minus 27, 23 and minus 2. And here also you got 8 minus 27, 23 and minus 2. This is, uh, you know, telling us that AB into C. Okay. This is telling us that uh, AB into C is same as A into BC. But then let me tell you, this is something which is known as distributive property. Okay. Now, this is not always true, okay. In this particular case, yes, it is true, but it is not always true, okay. It's not always that you will get this uh, two sides equal, okay. So, just uh, don't forget to remember this, okay. Now, next question is 22. 22. 22 is... Uh, a times F, okay, A times F, right, so I start with matrix A, which is uh, 2, minus 1, 3 and a 4, and then F is, uh, where is F, okay, F is a row matrix, it is 4 and then 5, okay, now let us check the compatibility first, this is 2 rows and 2 columns, so 2 by 2, this is two row, this is one row and two column, one by two. Now, can you see these two inner numbers? Okay, they are not equal. Okay, the number of uh, columns of the first matrix, number of columns of the first matrix is not equal to the number of rows of second matrix. Okay. And when these two are not equal, we say that the product is not possible. Product is not possible. So when the product is not possible only, there is no point in trying to find out AF. Okay. So the answer for this AF will be not possible. Okay. Now let us see what is the answer given behind the book for this 22. And for 22, the answer given is just a blank. Okay. They have just given a blank like this. Okay. That means it is not possible. Okay. So, let us move on to 23. 23 says that find the product of CK. CK. Okay, fine. So, what is our C and what is our K? Let us see. So, C is uh, uh, 4 and a 3, 1 and minus 2. This is C. And then K happens to be your 1 and minus 3, then 0 and 1, and uh, minus 7 and uh, 0. Okay. So, let us check the compatibility. This is 2 by 2 matrix. This is 3 by 2 matrix. Can you see this 2 and this 3? Not equal. Okay. Therefore, not possible. So, answer for this 23 is also not possible. Okay. So, let us move on to 24. 24th is uh, GF. G and a F. Okay. Now, let us see what is GF. 
so my g happens to be a uh, uh, column matrix it is 4 1 and a 3 and my f is a row matrix it is 4 and 5 okay so let us check the compatibility this is uh, three rows and one column three by one okay three rows one column this is one row and two column okay so one by two now here you can see that these two are matching okay so the number of columns of the first matrix is equal to the number of rows of the second matrix both are one and one therefore yes it is possible the product is possible and the product will be of order what will be the order of the product it will be this 3 cross 2 okay so the order of the resultant product of this gf will be 3 by 2 3 by 2 means you will have 3 rows and 2 columns so can i put this way 3 rows and 2 columns right okay now let us go for the answers okay now first particular place this one is a11 so for a11 i'll take the first row and the first column see this is first column okay just a four first row of the first matrix and first column of the second matrix so four fours are 16 plus uh one second huh? this should be four first row and first column okay so four into four one second huh? this is a bit tricky it is four one three so three rows and one column and this is one row and two columns right so it will be three by two so three rows and two columns okay so this will be a one one so i'll take the first row and multiply by the first column am i right yeah so this will be four one three multiplied by four that should give me 4 into 4 16 uh, uh, this one is uh, let me check this one okay uh, yeah it will be now see this is an entire uh, thing okay so you have to take only the first row and the first column first row is 4 and that you have to multiply this with this 4 so 4 into 4 will be 16 so I'll get a 16 over here now this place is a12 okay so first row is this and second column is this so you have to multiply 4 into 5 which is equal to 20 so i'll get a 20 over here okay so next is this position now this position is a21 second row first column so what i'll do i'll take the second row of the first matrix second row of the first matrix is this one it has only one element one and that you have to multiply by the first column that is four so one into four this is equal to four so i'll write a four over here then this one this is a two two so second row that is this and second column that is this so one into five five then this one okay that is uh, a three one so third row of the first matrix that is 3 multiplied by first column that is 4. So 3 4s are 12. And this will be uh, second uh, uh, third row and the second column. So this is 3 and then 5. 3 into 5 is 15. So this is your answer for this 24th. So let me check the answer for 24th. And for 24th the answer is 16, 20, 4, 5, 12 and 15 perfect so that was question number 24 now let us do one more question before i wind up today's session so 25th 25th is uh, it's a matrix b bracket 2a fine so this you will have to write it in this way matrix b i'll write first it is uh, 0, 5, 1 and minus 2. This is matrix B. Then I am going to write this 2 and matrix A. Matrix A is uh, 2 minus 1 and this is 3 and then this is 4. Okay. 
this is how you have to write it okay you should not ever try to change or uh, uh, change the order of the matrix okay you have to go in the same order from left to right okay don't make any changes in that because commutative property is not being obeyed in the case of matrix multiplication okay now first i'm going to reduce this so this i'm keeping as it is 0 5 1 and minus 2 and this will get reduced to this is a scalar multiplication okay scalar multiplication of a matrix so this 2 will be getting multiplied by each and every element so it will be 4 2 minus 1 2 minus 2 2 3 will be 6 2 4 will be 8 that's it now this is simple 2 by 2 matrix and this is 2 by 2 matrix so the answer for this will be uh, first row first column okay 0 into 4 0 6 5 is 30 0 plus 30 is 30 first row second column 0 into minus 2 0 8 5 is 40 so 40 second row first column 4 1 is 4 and minus 12 4 minus 12 is 4 minus 12 is minus 8 okay second row and second column so 1 into 2 minus 2 is minus 2 and this is minus 16 so minus 18 that's the answer let us check the answer quickly for 25th the answer is uh, 30 and a 40 in the first row and in the second row it is minus 8 and minus 18 perfect okay so 25 questions are complete and uh, today's session i am going to wind up here only if you happen to like my video okay please uh, subscribe my channel okay and uh, please uh, press the like button as well so that i'll be uh, uh, encouraged to make more and more beautiful videos in the future okay see you then take care all of you goodbye